Hi, my name's Kurt Mayer and I'm representing Australia in construction steel work at Leipzig 2013 International World Skills. In Australia we go to TAFE one day a week and we also are employed at the same time for the other four days. So we learn most of our skills on the job and then the other day at TAFE you learn all your more intricate skills that you can pass on in your workplace. Uh, preparation for the competition, I've been preparing for probably two years now. It started off at a national level, uh, training one day a week sort of thing and by the time it got accepted into the international team after winning nationals, it bumped up to two days a week and closer to the competition we're spending three and four days a week trying to get to where I am now. We do a lot of oxy cutting, which is um, cut the steel manually instead of using a guillotine folding. Folding is pretty complex when you have to be going to the tolerances that we are. My tasks today include building module one. It has to be complete by the end of the day. And because there's so many people here wanting to use the guillotine and the folder, I've had to move on to module two and start marking in out and working on that so I can keep myself busy whilst I'm waiting for the machinery. So far the competition's been pretty good. Haven't had too many problems. There's big weight to get on the machinery and uh, the guillotine and folder because of so many people, but that's just the way it is and you have to deal with it, work through it and move on as best as you can. A lot of people that I've spoken to have explain them as the hardest four days of their life. They still remember them 20 years later, so I'm expecting it to get pretty intense once I start to get moving along with the project, and hopefully it all goes to plan, but nothing ever really goes to plan, does it? So I'll have to work through it as best as I can and, and make the most of what I've got.